Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke, also Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. So yesterday was quite a busy day, and while out in Milton Keynes, after Ikea, we went on a toy hunt. So I love a toy hunt, but it was a bit different for me, because my son has got all these uh, Christmas money to spend. Uh, now, I'm, <laughs> now I love the Star Wars, and I like looking at the Star Wars, we're in Smith's Toys at the moment, but my son's looking for something called... I think I mentioned it on a couple of videos back. Five Nights at Freddy's, or five, yeah, Five Nights at Freddy's, because he's got the, uh, what's that? That VR, is it Inoculus? He got one of those for Christmas, from Father Christmas. So um, yeah, he's well into his Five Nights at Freddy's. So he's been looking for, um, um, what are they, the, the Funko Pops, and, and Funko make other action figures and stuff. So, he's, so yeah, he's got his Christmas money. So we saw these, this is Smith's Toys, but they had some, nice, they had some nice, half decent Funko Pops. I love the ET one. Just got no room to to put it anywhere. But no, it was it was good. They had a few few good deals in there. He picked up this that Funko Pops as well. I was looking for this is in Milton Keynes. So I was looking for um, the uh, the Batman, Superman, Superpower figures and and the Flash that I'd seen last week in Stevenage. But and I, they had them there, so I was going to pick up Batman for a ten pounds, and I forgot to buy it. So, yeah, I didn't. I didn't pick that up because obviously I've got my Christmas money as well. But I love. I do love a toy hunt. Good selection of Hot Wheels. Um, I've got. I've, I've got most of the Batmobiles, and I need to open them up. But um, yeah, I was just seeing if I had any um, any of the new uh, Night Rider cars because I do like a kit. Um, yeah, it was. It was a. It was a good. Uh, you know, they had a good selection of uh, toys in there. I haven't been to the um, Smiths in Milton Keynes oh, for a good few years. But this was amazing. This was absolutely fantastic. Check this out. Press it again. <laughs> so, so this is, uh, um, it's, like a, it's like a Bluetooth speaker. And I, oh, honestly, I've, I've not seen one of these before. It looks absolutely amazing. So um, yeah, definitely have to put it on my Christmas list for, uh, for next year from the wife. But yeah, that was good. So um, after um, Smith's Toys, we then moved on to uh, b and And again, I've never been to this B&M before. And they had the McDonald's Funko Pops. And I love, I love the old school um, McDonald's. They're only five pounds, five pounds. So I've got the Ronald McDonald. Um, I'm not really interested in, in that chick. I don't know what that is, um, but the, I can't remember his name, the policeman burger. He was um he was dented and I would have bought him if he weren't dented. But it's a good selection of toys like turtles and those transformers. They looked good as well. Um no do well the, the usual sus well I say usual suspects. There was no Doctor Who uh, character options figures whatsoever. This was quite a small BM. It looked bigger um on on the outside. It's it's the one next to a, it's next to Morrison's. I I don't really know Milton Keynes that well. The, and and um, Catwoman looked good as well. And after after that, we went to Tesco's, and I think it's Tesco's in Bletchley, Milton Keynes. I, again, I haven't been to this one for years, but I do remember there was a comic book shop behind it, and also it had the most Funko Pops I'd ever seen. And this was about four or five years ago, last time I went here. And honestly, it didn't disappoint. My son, he picked up, he managed to get his Funko Pops Five Nights at Freddy's. He picked up these two figures these tie-dye figures as well. He was tempted to get them, them, but he was running out of <laughs> he was running out of Christmas money. So they're going on his birthday list for March. He'd already picked up that little set from Smith's Toys. And then I was looking at the Lego, and um, I've been after the Star Wars um, Lego Death Trooper um, set from the Mandalorian. I've been looking, I've been after it for some time, but it's I think it was 1999 on Amazon for a time. It's gone up now to 30, I think. But your box always ends up dented. But I had it in, in Tesco's, £17.50. I couldn't believe it. It's the cheapest I've ever seen it. So I snapped it up straight away. So, um, yeah, I got a nice little... Uh, nice li <laughs> another, another toy for me for 2023. So I've, I've, got to, I've got to stop buying. I've got to stop buying toys. I've, 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 I've got too much. And it's only... It's only the 8th, when, well, the 8th was yesterday when I was out doing this. And this ET, I've got my ET, my talking ET, but this, this, those ET plushes were, were amazing.
But obviously, um, after after a whole day shopping, I do get hungry, so I popped to the Nut and Squirrel, which again was next to that um, Morrison's and uh, B and M, um, and had a mixed grill. And I got to say, it was a, it was a very quiet pub. There was not many people eating in there, so you, so you always get alarm bells. But the food was totally totally amazing, really really good. I think it was fourteen pound fifty for this mixed grill. So service was rubbish, but. <laughs> But the actual food was amazing, so highly recommended. Let your eyes be a guide. So that's the end of the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. Join me in the next one, which will be later on this week, because uh, I'm going to uh, Lakeside. <laughs> so hopefully do a bit of toy hunting there as well. So I'll see you in the next one. Catch you then.